Hello, Hello Floss Tube. Tube. We're the, the Real Housewives of Crossstitch. I'm Priscilla. I'm Chelsea. I'm back. <laughs> and we're back. We're here to talk to you about our stitching this week. Where'd you go? I went to <laughs> Virginia. Hillcrest Mansion, right? Mm -hmm. I flew into Roanoke and it's about 45 minutes from there to the we're doing a video. The bed and breakfast where the retreat was at. It was a very small retreat. I think 12 attendees. But they fed you morning, noon, and night, and it was really nice. The scenery out the front door was, like, amazing. They had pumpkins lining the stairs, which I and another... Shelly? Yeah. Another, Her and Shelly redecorated. Yeah. Because they had just put them up on the porch, and they hadn't had time to... So we put all the mums and everything out, and Shelly's like, you went and bought pumpkins and mums? I'm I was like, so confused. No. <laughs> I was no, sleep deprived. We carved pumpkins. We finished our projects. We ate. <laughs> yeah, she sent some really good pictures of food. Mm -hmm. That's something that my family always likes. Is we love food, <laughs> so she would send. F and we knew that stuff she wasn't eating, so she was taking pictures of her neighbor's food or something because there was stuff like shrimp that she won't eat seafood. Um, yes, I intimate, did take a picture very of that fun. So you could see it. Yes. You went downtown? Yes, we walked downtown one day and we drove downtown the other day. So this was the project that we finished. And you will be able to get it in our Etsy shop this weekend. Reindeer Ride mm -hmm. is what it's called, Reindeer Ride. So you'll see this in our Etsy shop this weekend as a PDF only. Mm -hmm. uh, super cute. What was the size on this? Five by seven. Yeah, so seven inches tall, five inches wide. Mm -hmm. um, it's a smaller basket than the Let's Go or the Back Up the Truck one. <laughs> she stole it my is um, listed on the back of the chart. Priscilla's pretty plaids in red and white for the love of God. Um, this is the Housewives ribbon. Where'd you get the greenery? Walmart. What about the pick? Walmart? Walmart, Walmart. Okay, Walmart. Easy, very. It's uh, like it's really compact. So compared to the my other basket one. is crooked. Oh. I don't know if you can see that. Oh, yeah. So make sure when you buy the basket, you make sure that yours is not crooked. See, it's a little, it, it's, it doesn't stand up even. Oh, no. Okay. I hang it from those hooks in that new mudroom closet. And I mean, if you if you need to, you can keep your luggage tags in it. <laughs> I carried it on. You can keep your snack in it. Of course, when I got on the plane the first day, the guy next to me, and I was way in the back of the plane... <laughs> You can book your own airfare, that'd be perfectly fine. Anyway, he just shuts the window immediately, and I was, like, trying to stitch, because I knew that I had to get stuff done, so I had my phone propped up against me with my flashlight on, trying to stitch. She had it, like, stuck between her boobs, just... No, I didn't. <laughs> and... For the first time ever, the stewardess did not even ask us if we wanted anything to drink. Wasn't it, like, a ten-minute flight? No, it was... Almost two hours, oh, hour and a half or whatever. But the people, every, everybody around us, they asked. But she was like an older lady, so she must have forgot. Maybe I put you like in real, real economy or something. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Seriously? <laughs> no, I don't know. I don't know. I've not, not heard of that. But but you got Well, on the way home, they asked me if I wanted something. Oh. But on the way home, I had to <laughs> I had to get up at four in the morning to leave by four thirty to get on the plane at seven, mm -hmm. and then I got home at seven forty nine because of the time change. Yep, picked up so, her dogs. Mm -hmm. Her dogs are Can happy to see her. Stop showing your butt to everyone, please. Uh, we did have some questions this week. We'll jump into that. <laughs> <laughs> uh, JD's oh Shul, what is your favorite green and red to use for Christmas stitching? Ribbon steam, red. Steam broccoli, ribbon red. Little sprout. Little sprout, four leaf clover, licorice red if you're going for a more mm -hmm. vintage -ish All right, now red. you're giving her too many choices. Okay. Ribbon red and probably a little sprout for me. Sue, you mentioned a couple of new classic color works colors. I'm wondering if you can mention the names again. Summer Sky and Marmalade. Summer Sky is the deeper blue that is used in our January month to month. And Marmalade we used in the Adorables Fall. Which, I don't know where I put that. Belinda, I'm new here. I just started following you. How do we find out about retreats? We just announced them here. So we are guests at all these retreats. We don't host our own. We just mm -hmm. let you know when they're going in and you would go to their page or mm -hmm. website, wherever they have signups to find out more information. Yes. Uh, Jackie, what is, the retreat you, blah, 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 blah. what is the retreat you're attending in North Carolina? We are going to Asheville. 
and it's with the Annabella's shop. Mm -hmm. And we leave next Thursday. Carriel, what brand of leggings does Chelsea wear? I thought she said at one time they repel animal hair. Yes, so the Halara um, is what mom got me for Christmas. She got them for Destiny too. I washed and dried mine, so they lost that repellent, but they do fit really well. They have pockets. You can wash them. You just shouldn't dry them in the dryer. Yeah, right. But other than that, I just go to Home Goods or TJ Maxx, I mean, and get leggings there. But Halara, I'm going to order a couple. I get a lot on Amazon, and they're fine. Yeah. But those were pretty expensive, those Halara ones. Because of the... But everybody says that they're the greatest, so... The cut on them, The way like... that I saw them was on TikTok. Yeah, they yeah. suck your stomach in. Yeah. Like, you have that problem. No, but it's just a nice cut. Like, if you're going to wear that <laughs> in a crop top or something, it looks cute. Okay. Um, Je Jeannie, Chelsea, I've been meaning to ask you, did you ever finish the Home Alone house? I saw the movie on the other day and thought of you. No, I need to do a whip parade of all my whips. I was looking through all those the other day, and whew, holy moly... Zuko's mom. Priscilla, are you worried about the puppy with your Christmas things this year? No. Mm -mm. She won't tell you if the puppy goes wild. <laughs> I will too tell them if the puppy goes wild. No, she doesn't. Like, the only thing that she touches in mine are my shoes. And she messed up the gate because she was trying to get the cat food. That was it. And occasionally she'll steal, like, the whole floss card. But <laughs> she doesn't touch anything else. And I have a lot of things that like there's a hutch in the family room where she could get underneath and grab stuff out all the time. She doesn't. And I keep it gated so she won't be in the living room where the village is because otherwise she might be sitting in the middle of it like the rest of the animals <laughs> around here do. Janice, the beads in your Amazon shop... <laughs> The beads in your Amazon shop are painted plaid, but when I look at your finished pieces, it looks like the beads are covered with plaid fabric. Is an illusion. Yes. Yeah, there's no fabric. There's no fabric there. Unless there is, and it's, like, dyed, or, like, um, they put a coating over it or something. It doesn't feel like fabric. Yeah, I think they're just printed on. Mambo Baxter, where did you get the hot cocoa cup on the Dear Santa backer board, please? <coughs> Hobby Lobby. And all that stuff is listed on the back of the chart. And we talked about it all last week in the video. Jamie, I'm a member of the month-to-month -month group. I'm an Australian. I'm wondering the July month-to-month, -month, is it going to be patriotic or summer? That way I can swap the summer. season. Summer. Laura, I just remembered today that I threw away the old tree after Christmas last year, so I need to go shopping. Where do you get your trees? I want a tall, skinny one. So a lot of mine come from Walmart. Um, I did buy a new one from Amazon this year. I got like an open box one, and I have not set it up yet, so I don't know how it's going to be. I have to do some rearranging before I can bring my Christmas in, but I so want to get that started. Mm -hmm. Mighty One, on your home pattern, you offer three separate patterns, so how are they different? Home is where the wreath is, is the first in the series that has a basic wreath, the letters H, M, and E. Reswap 1 is the first six months of the year for you to change out, January through June, and then Reswap 2 is July through uh, December of the different wreaths, so like mm -hmm. uh, scarecrows or pumpkins. Mm -hmm. Christmas you change stuff. out the O. The O is a wreath, and you change it out every month if you are wanting to do that. Yep. Kathleen, where do you get your zipper project bags from? The zipper ones are from soulfulcreations.com. It's Amanda Badger's company. Soul, S-O-U-L-E, full I don't, I don't know, but I wouldn't consider those a bag. I would consider those more of a folder. But our regular project bags that we use a lot of, those are from, well, we use our own from Fat Quarter Shop, and then Creative Carol makes the zipper bags that we use. Some of them, yeah. We have a, a lot of different people that have given us bags. Uh, Shannon, love your fabric for my Christmas list. Can you share how you dyed it? I think it was denim blue, and then coffee tea dyed. I think you did a blog post on it. When you were updating the colors. Probably. Probably. Okay, that's all the questions I have this week. All right, so I wanted to show you a couple of previouses. Previouses? Previouses? <laughs> Finishes? Yeah, I went to Virginia, now I came home and I can't talk. <laughs> so this was um, our Jolly Housewives piece last year that was special where you could only get it for like two weeks at the Fat Quarter Shop and then it came to our Etsy shop also so you could get it both places. This is Buffalo Plague Christmas. And we're doing a special chart like that again this year. It'll, it'll be available first at Fat Quarter Shop for a couple weeks and then it'll be in our Etsy shop. So I'll give you a little sneak peek today, but it's not far. 
And then, Joy to the World. Joy to the World. This was from our Jolly July. No. Yeah. Jolly July, right? You don't remember? It wasn't the Nashville exclusive. No, that was the Jingle Bell Cafe. This was from Jolly July. But anyway, this is Joy of the World, and this cabinet has the door on it that you can open. Oh. <laughs> Joy to the World. Yes. So that's available at shops and in our Etsy shop. All right. So these are yours. I don't know why this is here. This um, week in the Etsy shop? I thought we'd do this first. Oh. So at the retreat, Shelly, she had sent us those Walmart houses. She found like three of them and sent them to us a long time ago. And a bunch of those blocks. Um, the Michael's blocks. Ooh, cute. Starlight Stitching Co. Yep. So she had one of those made for everybody at the retreat with our fabrics. Yes. Starlight Stitching Co. did or Shelly had? Shelly had Starlight oh. Stitching Co. make them all. These are amazing. Yes. I love it with the stripes. Yes. Super cute. Okay. Thank you, Shelly. All right. And then they did a little smalls exchange. I did not participate in it, but she did. And she made one for the smalls exchange and one for each of us. These are the cutest things ever. We have our, our fabrics on them. This is the chart oh, from our um, May. Calendar trait. Yeah. Ooh. Yeah. Okay, and so it's, it's a little box, so I'll go through it. So There's a little tape measure. My favorite scissors. It has the little feet. It's all like decoupaged, Mod Podge, cover button. So cute to sit next to your stitching area. Oh my heck, a little tape measure. Yep. Needle. Love it. So cute. A little drawer down here. You're very crafty. Yeah. Shelly. So, and they, they had special bags made and t-shirts. I didn't bring my t-shirt down here, but this was the bag that they gave to everybody that attended. Cute. Oh, they've got your logo on it. This was put on by Punch Needle Primitive Stitcher Magazine. I know. And there was today. like a little Mill Hill Santa and things like that inside. Awesome. All right, this week in the Etsy shop, I can do. <laughs> Just trying we to... concluded mm -hmm. our um, vintagey Christmas um, mm -hmm. theme for the tier tray tidbits. Mm -hmm. So that started with Joy. Joy. So I've gone to two different Hobby Lobbies trying to find this greenery. Santa's sleigh. That Santa one. sleigh, then Mary Claus, and then um, the Santa suite. And then there was a bonus with the Santa. Bonus with Santa suite. And it's really cute. Tutorial again in our tutorial tab, how to make the ornaments mm -hmm. like that. That one's the longer one. I link it on my um, blog every time I do the blog post for that. <laughs> We went to a little quilt shop when we were in, um, <laughs> Chelsea's like, what? I asked her if she paid for it. <laughs> I think it's cute. I don't, I feel like you need to have a seance with it or something. I don't know. You don't think she's a cute Christmas She's so seance? cute. Oh, I thought, yeah, she's so cute. So Harlow has a, a little friend that comes around and now that the, there's a different window in the front, he can see out and... I think she's a she. She's orange and white, so they would make the perfect Halloween bear. But she comes and stares in the window. So when I get up in the morning, the it's still dark outside, and the lights are always on, and they come on by motion. So she must sit there all night looking at him. Oh, they're in love. It's weird. <laughs> um, okay, so then Dapper Doodad, we have finished our Halloween town. The only thing that's not done is the banner, but Chelsea finished stitching all the letters. I just have to finish putting it together. Okay, so we'll show you these first. So first came Boo, then we had Haunted House, then we had Ghostly Manor, and then this week is Eek. This is all of them put together. I'll show you that. And this is separate. the banner part that we have. Again, this is Paisley's and Polka Dots. So I did go on, I did open up one of their packages because they sent us some stuff for giveaways. We'll show that next week. 
Um, they do recommend what paint colors you should use. That was something that I was looking at that if I had to go pick out paint colors, I'd be like, ugh. Um, <laughs> Kind of like when I have to pick out fancy floss. I just like her to tell me what color she wants me to use. Um, they do recommend what acrylic paint and they give you these full instructions. And if you have to um, decoupage, is it deco? Is it, what is it called? Mm -hmm. Mod Podge. Mm -hmm. If you have to do that on there, they give you the scrapbook paper to do it with. So it is I think a great you might kit. have to buy the, that separate though, don't you? Or did you the look? The paper? No, yeah. this came with the paper. Okay. Yeah. Um, so this is Eek. And this is the scalloped, it's so cute, scalloped stand. These are sold separately. They're little doodads. Each separately or you buy like a, a package with a bunch of different things? I think you buy a package things. of okay. them, yeah. But I'm just saying they don't come with the stand. So this you could finish but all, both ways. Um, and then the letters. I, I might take the magnets off of these and just glue them down. I was doing that because it's a lot easier to take a picture of it singly than it is yeah. on here. So... I think it turned out so cute, but the banner, we're going to hang it from the bottom. Okay. So, uh, she has the first letters. I hope I did the right letters. Yep. And speaking of retreats, I've been talking to several different people for retreats for next year. So we will have more. H A L L O then W E E wee <laughs> pumpkin. Okay, so N and the pumpkin came in with eek. Again, you'll get the different letters in the bottom of the chart. So I think that the front of the banner needs this and also the end of the banner. So she's going to make pumpkins. another pumpkin. Yeah. So cute. We do have a fun new series coming. It's not going to be a permanent series like what we have. It's going to be a here and there series mm -hmm. um, coming instead of tiered trade tidbits this Next week, you'll see it. This coming Wednesday, yep. So you'll see a new series. It'll be fun. Mm -hmm. You'll still like, it's still small, so it's still something that you can keep up with, weekly with if you wanted to, mm -hmm. etc. cetera. Okay, um, we did get some things right here. We got these gifts. This is from Barbara, oh, and she made us really pretty oh, no. bookmarks. You need to show your haul bookmarks. From Fat Quarter Shop, we got um, one of our, I think, floss kits. Yeah, the fine floss. Mm, I don't know what color it is. I got scissors. So we'll be giving away two things of silk floss. It is the orange. Wow. It's bright. Orange, pop orange popsicle. Really pretty. Candy corn. Yeah. Just um, so bite. two opportunities to win that this week. And then also at Fat Quarter Shop, they now started carrying this, which is so cute for your tear tray tidbits. They are little um, frosted pine cones. If you can see them in there. And then it comes with three of them. I think that those would be neat on like these bigger tiered trays. Yeah, your bigger tiered trays, or if you have those dole bowls too, mm -hmm. you could put them in there mm -hmm. as well. Um, really cute. So we'll have some of these to give away also. Okay. You're up with your haul. All right. Can you put this somewhere? That's how Yeah, bend over. I'll show you. <laughs> All right. So I... That's what she would say to me. So don't write me in the comments that I'm rude. That's what she She's rude. rude. I got a couple of right That's what she would say. Where'd you get right on? Um, when do you have tech? Holy balls. That one's for you. <laughs> it better be. That's so cute. <laughs> Sweet but twisted. That's me. <laughs> I feel like that is absolutely me. <laughs> I got one of those for me too. What did I watch this week? There's mine. What did I watch? Did you start the center yet? Is that bad? No, it's really good. Look at with aqua. Time to trim the tree. Super cute. This one's awesome. You didn't you didn't think I wanted this one. And I'm gonna be going to visit the the littles pretty soon, so I got a couple. Look at that. That's really cute. Oh, Cash had that I think. And a little sleeper. And There's... another little sleeper. Oh, I like that. Oh, I miss this. And another little sleeper. <laughs> oh, one more. You can hear them in there. 
But the pink and the stripes must be in style because that's two of them. Yeah. Isn't that cute? It is. Don't you want to wear it? Yeah, I would like pre-made outfits like that. I absolutely would. <laughs> All right. So then I, I placed three orders from Pack Order Shop. Most of them went in my suitcase last week, but I did get a couple of hoodies. I got some sticky board. They've been out of sticky board. I got our ribbons. Plus I got some extras of the black, bigger black check. And of course I got another couple of Christmas shirts. Jolly Housewives shirts. Yeah. They are super soft. And then I recommend one. we went Me to that too. quilt shop and the two people I was with, Susie and Shelly, both bought this one fabric that was really cute. But I, I, I think I would want this. I struggle, huh? You didn't think I would want this? Well, you can order. I struggle with the, um, just be a nice gift for watching the, your senile dog. <laughs> watching a cat, you didn't like it. Huh? <laughs> you can't talk about Piper that way. <laughs> Piper was, she, okay, she was actually really good. She went out to the grass and peed in the grass. Here she just like plops herself down on the patio and says, here's good enough. <laughs> she went into the grass. I think she's scared of me. But when she got there, the chickens all like surrounded her and then. <laughs> It was like a gang of chickens. Um, Ronnie was, Ronnie was good. She was fine. She didn't bark a lot. She was probably mad I made her sleep in. I didn't get up at 3 a.m. with her. But. I got more sticky board. But anyway, we went to that quilt shop and they bought some of this fabric. It was this top fabric right here. And I'm not good at like picking out a bunch of other ones to go with it. I wanted, but there was no like kits. So I got back to the, the mansion and I <laughs> ordered some from that quarter shop. So it is, can you tell them what oh, it is? Oh yeah, they do have it. Uh, I'm ordering it real quick. Um, they, it's called Kimberbell Cup of Cheer. Let me pull up the... But there's little ice skates, there's mittens, there's trucks, there. you know, all those I good things. If you can see this really well. That's cute. Look at the little ski hill. Or no, that's a like a hot cocoa shack. Yep. Okay, that's cute. Mm -hmm. How many did you get? Five. Okay. Um, I, I always think that I can mix like our checks and stuff with it, but yeah, th they just had like a couple of different fabrics from it where you would buy yardage. So um, the lady did show us her long arm machine working. So that was interesting. Um, it just like hooks up to her iPad and mm, away she goes. Yeah. Do you want to show your whips since they're here to see your stitching? Oh, I was trying to think of what else I was going to tell them, but I don't know what I want to show. What do we want to show? My eyes twitching. Just like this? Show it all. They can't tell. So on Tuesday. Tuesday. I wish I had my phone in here so I could show you the picture. But oh. if we stop, I'll show you the picture. Tuesday. Um, don't you know I have such it in here. Presley. You Presley had a hair appointment. So it was her first one. I took her in. I dropped her off. She was all excited to be there. I went over to Home Goods and looked around. That's where I got the cups. And then I ran into Hobby Lobby because I was looking for more of this greenery, which I cannot find anywhere. And I got a call <laughs> to come back and pick her up because she had had a bath and then she pooped herself. And then she had, they had to clean her up again and then she pooped herself again. And so I had to come her back, come and get her because she had pooped herself twice. So she didn't get her hair done. So I got her in the car. And <laughs> she's a, 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 a beauty pageant dropout, believe me. Beauty school dropout. Oh, we carved pumpkins too. I forgot about that. Gosh, where is she? <laughs> Was after that. That's not it. That's it. <laughs> she looks like Marv. <laughs> Marv. <laughs> What's the other guy's name? I knew it the other day. <laughs> Marv and who? And then, and then the minute she got in the car, she asked for a pup cup. So. <laughs> right. oh, okay. All right. And she got a toy before we left the store too. 
they're like, just bring her back in another four to five weeks and we'll, we'll try again. And I'm like, yeah, I think I'm going to find someplace else. But <laughs> so if any of you have problems with your dog like that, can you tell me what I need to do? CBD. But it's so funny because I told Chelsea, I said, she's a perfect dog for me. I said, you know, it's just like my kids, always needy. Always needing something. The principal was always calling home is what she actually said. <laughs> Not for me. For her three younger children. The principal was always calling or she had to do their schoolwork or something was going on. Athletic directors or they were getting thrown out of the locker room. Just something. Something. No. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. All right. So, um, following so, that. I'm going to just show you this. Oh, sorry. I forgot. You didn't do it. There's a big S. This is our special, and it's not Santa. It doesn't say Santa. Stitching. No. Slow. <laughs> Snow. Round about that. Yes. <laughs> All right. Uh, so we had giveaways last week. I no, think. we have to show our... Oh, releases. I haven't been here for a long time. <laughs> So, All right, so we did show you last week, right? Yes. Well, last week we showed you January. This is January. This is Santa's hot cocoa. He's adorable. Talk about that again. People missed it. Talk about it again. What do you mean, talk about it again? Okay, the backer is the Santa. Dear Santa, right? Yep. yep. Santa's list or something like that. It's just the Santa and the backer board, the base <laughs> with down. it. Okay, where's the hot cocoa from? Um, Hobby Lobby. Everything's from Hobby Lobby. But what is, because it's hard to see what's attached okay. and what's not. Th there's a cup. It's from Hobby Lobby. Lobby. There's a little ornament from the ornament section of Hobby Lobby that's a spoon. I took something off of that. I don't know if it was a ribbon and I put our ribbon on the top. The little trees are from Hobby Lobby. This is from Hobby Lobby. Um, what's up here? This is from Hobby Lobby and that's our ribbon. And that greenery is from Hobby Lobby that I can't find. I love this stuff because it's flat. Oh, yeah. Um, but this came from Paisley's and Polka Dots. And like I said, she paints our things before she sends them to us because... They are unpainted, unfinished when you get them. She gives you really good directions, though, on how to finish them. And like this is that pattern stuff, so you would get the pattern paper with it. The pattern paper is already cut out in the shape that you need. You don't have to like cut it out, but you will have to attach it. She gives you directions on how to do it. But anything you buy there right now, I, I believe, is unfinished. You have to paint it yourself, but that's part of the project. It's fun. We just don't necessarily mm -hmm. have that time. And well, she wants her projects to look really good for us to show. But so. <laughs> I think that I think that it would be totally totally doable for us. It's just that we don't have the time and we'd like to present hers, you know, with her touch to it. <laughs> My Santa would look. <laughs> All right, so hot cocoa, this one's called. Again, these are coming out. The shops will get their email today. Um, so you can do, start doing pre-orders. Mm -hmm. We have to figure out shipping, um, printing. All right, and then this is January's Let's Go Ride a Bike. Winter Woods. The... Bike basket has a fox in it. There's cardinals all around. And then there's a big chubby snowman in the wagon that the bike is pulling. So cute. Snow so wintry. I used um, the Stitching Housewife stripes in white with red and then blue in the Chelsea's checks. <laughs> Having fun in there. <laughs> okay. Now giveaways? I think that that's all I have to show. Gosh, I hope that's all I have to show. All right, giveaways last week. We had Mary Claus. <laughs> Mary Claus goes to Stitches of Sass, Jenny McKelvey, and Hannah J. Uh, email me what you want. The email address is listed below. Yeah. Ghostly Manor was the... Uh, Ghostly Manor. That goes to Judy Greenhow and Melissa Kiefer. Then we had Gunmetal Classic Color Works Floss. So oh, that, that's why that was there. Yes. Yes. It's right here. Uh, so this package, you'll get a new one unopened. Uh, that goes, and that's from Fat Quarter Shop. Thank you, Kimberly and team. That goes to Stephanie Laffman and Susan Metivier. This then, was, this was part of my haul, too. I got a bunch of red ribbon. 
these beautiful creative uh, creative Carol folders. These go to Margaret Anderson and Robert Cass. Congratulations. Then we have the thread spool, and I'm going to throw in a chart for you, a Christmassy chart. That goes to Tonic Caddy and Farm Boys Love. Again, that is from the Plaid Moose Carving Studio. And he is the Plaid Moose Carving Studio on Facebook. Then we have the Fall Adorables PDF. This is the one that we said that we use the marmalade in. That's the door, right? And the, the pumpkins, right? Pumpkins? Yeah, the door. The door. The pumpkins. When Jolas, Dawn Pape, and Stitching with Sandy. Oh, yeah. Then we had Welcome Pumpkin, Bittersweet Farm. Have you seen all the people finishing that? Yes, it's amazing. Yeah. Diane Stadola, Monica Huggins, and Katie Golden. Congratulations. Congratulations. Um, okay, there we go. It's so nice to see all the finishes. Yes. Again, email me. If I need your physical address, make sure you include it in there and tell me what you want. It makes it 10 times easier. Get your stuff faster because I don't have to go back and forth emailing you. That's my soapbox. I'm off of it. Okay. Next, we have giveaways for this week. What's in that bag? That's this week's that we have to give away. Okay. I already showed it. You already opened that stuff? This is the um, floss fix. This is the gun metal that I have to take home okay. with me. And this is the fine floss. It was the um, candy corn orange oranges um and then we need to do these okay and then we have these okay um this week in giveaways the first one is going to be santa sweet and it comes with a bonus comes with the bonus three opportunities to win that number four is eek let's make it look professional eek and that comes with the letters the um, N and the pumpkin. So you can put a pumpkin on the beginning or the end or both. They stitch up pretty quick. Then number three is three opportunity. Wait, number three is uh, three opportunities to win from Fat Quarter Shop, the tiered tray or dough bowl, frosted pine cones. That's number three. Number four is two opportunities to win the fine floss and that's that orange popsicle color. Thank you, Kimberly and team. That's number four. Number five is from Paisley's and Polka Dots. The Elf. There's one of these. That's number five. And then number six is two oppor one opportunity to win the Elf. Six is two opportunities to win uh, Letters to Santa. So, yes, that is what it's called. It says Dear Santa on there, but she covered it up. You see it comes with the paper to do everything. I'm going to... Mine had that glued on, and I had to pry some of it off because it would show. So I pried some of it off and then I raised up. But theirs will not. The No, you don't have to use it for that, but you can save it for something else. Yeah, theirs will not come glued on. Um, okay, so they you do cut them out, but they're... Um, so I take back what I said earlier. You have to cut on the line. Super simple to do. It's already drawn on there. Just cut out the line. Super easy. Okay. Then, it, and it's all written on what colors you should use, etc. And they probably tell you what to do first. There's been a lot of posts in our group lately about how easy it is, and they've been doing pieces and polka dots since before, etc. What number was that? The last number is going to be um, 10 opportunities to win. No, because I wanted to give away the Joy to the World and the... All right, then what number is it? The um, one, two, Buffalo Plaid. Three, four, five, six. Number seven is going to be three opportunities to win Joy to the World. That's a PDF. Number eight is three opportunities to win Reindeer Ride PDF. Number nine is three opportunities to win Buffalo Plaid Christmas. <laughs> Buffalo Plaid Christmas. Number nine. And then number 10 is five opportunities to win a pick a chart. So you pick a chart from our Etsy shop. Okay. All right. So what else? We're going to go see that movie. Follow us on Instagram at Priscilla Blaine, at Chelsea356, Priscilla's2000 on Facebook, and Priscilla's2000.blogspot.com where you can see more about our new releases. Also, 
If you get your finishing inspiration from us, tag us, tag my blog. We'd love to see your projects. Coming up shortly too, we will be doing a live with Fat Quarter Shop Kimberly showing all of our uh, Jolly Housewives and Christmassy designs. Mm -hmm. So you'll need to stay tuned for that. We'll let you know the date uh, as soon as we can. Mm -hmm. Okay. We hope that you're getting ready for Jolly Housewives. You're getting all of your things kitted up. We've got some more Christmas coming out mm -hmm. that you, um, you I love. think you'll, you'll really love. All right, we appreciate you spending your time with us. So happy Halloween. What are they going to answer? Happy Halloween. We showed you those three new pieces. Three new pieces. Well, we'll throw in Reindeer Ride, too. Yeah, Reindeer we Ride. We four new pieces. So there's Reindeer Ride. Why are you looking at me? Winter hot Woods, cocoa. Hot Cocoa, and January, month to month. Yeah, so pick your favorite and tell us what your favorite is. Yeah. Okay. And tell us what you're dressing up for for Halloween. What are you going to be? I'm going to be me. <laughs> That's about all I can handle. I, I got a needy dog. I don't know <laughs> how much cash is going to trick or treat, so we didn't go all out like we did last year. We did all, all out. We were going to be the Grinch people this year. You can year, do but... it next year. Yep, we'll do it next year. They all say right. the Grinch stuff is really popular for Christmas. I just it don't is. see that here. If I had kids' rooms, maybe I would do that. Cash loves loves the Grinch. Not the scary Grinch. He likes the cartoony one. Not the scary one. I put on the scary one one time and he, like, traumatized. Like, <laughs> great. All right, we appreciate you spending your time with us. We will see you next week. Bye.